Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. When we last left off, we uh, we lost Ashley again. Uh, you know, our friend Osmond decided to steal her from us uh, and awakening the beast inside, shall we say. Uh, never mind, I mean, you know, good thing we had one of those nifty tracker devices. You know, totally in incognito trackers, I should say. Anyway, let's not worry too much about that right now. Let's get out of here. So, what do we have? Our plan. Uh, because of that agent, we lost Chief Mendez and Raman. Or Raymond. Raman? Raymond? Yeah, him. Nevertheless, everything will proceed according to plan. I must admit, however, the loss of my loyal men is a bit disheartening. But I will deal with it. Replacing that loss will not come easy. I must choose wisely, for the plagger reflects the conscience of their host. If chosen poorly, they could betray me. I need men who will swear their allegiance to me. I've learned my lesson when Sarah betrayed me. I will not make the same mistake t again. This, In this important hour, I cannot and will not have anyone stand in my way. Uh, he's kind of mourning the loss of his brave men, which is questionable, but all right, man, okay, okay. Uh, so, do we have any treasure coming up? Uh, not for a while. We've got to go meet an old buddy, an old pal of ours, haven't we? <clears throat> What's the news on our friend, Leon? He's not making it easy. The sample? Sadler's got it. It seems he sniffed out our little game. Perfect. Just so we understand each other clearly, I don't trust you, nor does Wesker. If you try to do anything clever, I will kill you. Is that so? You know, I met Wesker long before you. We'll see soon enough if you did. Yeah, we'll see. Hmm. <laughs> I wouldn't threaten Ada if I was you. She's uh, a little bit tougher than you're giving her credit for. I think she would eat you for breakfast, my lad. Anyway, uh, okay, cool. I like that. We'll see if you did. Well, surely it's factual whether you did meet her first or whatever. Who knows? Uh, so, we have... Oh, we have a nice little... Uh, room up there with some goodies in it I think well we'll get there eventually come on dude step right up ah oh, look at that he's got his little tickling stick I don't know what you intend to do with your tickling stick sir but I don't want none of that near any of my orifices if you don't mind oh dear you're one of them uh, of course you are we don't like them that's okay keep you at bay and somebody is shooting bolts at us, which is a little bit awkward. But we shall deal with that as and when. Yeah, if you could keep your flailing tentacle away from my orifices, I would be really happy. Don't want none of that, son. Come on. Take your medicine. Really? Leon. There we go. It's okay. I've got a few more bullets. Are you going to be this greedy or, you know, come on, meet me halfway here. I'm trying to free you of your torment. Thank you. Jeez, you would have thought you'd have been a little bit more grateful. What's in the bag, anyway? Oh, hmm. Definitely want to hold on to that. We've got a beastie coming up. So we're going to need to use that one. Ah, we've, uh, oh, yeah, we've got options, I suppose. We don't have a huge amount of ammo, do we? Uh, okay. Well, you know, that's fine. We might not have a huge amount, but uh, we've got enough. Right, so, I remember this bit. Hello. Why don't you come around the corner, dude? Come on. Come on. No? Alright. Alright, well, I guess we're just gonna knife you guys. Please don't be head bobbers. Nope, you're not a head bobber. You, though, 
can go down on one knee so I can smash your brain. You don't mind, do you? Nah, you're alright. You're one of the good ones, aren't you, dude? Oh, he's out of range of me knife. That's no good. That's it. Stay in the corner, dude. There you go. Sweet, sweet serenity for you. Oh, hello. Oh. Dude, come on. I would like that. Ow, that was right in the neck. Alright. Let's see if we can be a little bit more tactical. Put that axe down. Hey, ah. Oh, you silly boy. Come on. Alright, can we just... There we go. S stay out of range of that knob with the... Uh... Oh, hello. Come on. There you go. Nice try. Give you the old bait. Bait you in. Come on. Hey, come on. There we go. Oh, we run out of uh, backpedaling space. That was my fault. All right, let's finish you off nice and quick like. Oh, God. Not what we wanted, was it? All right, let's try and get this sack of shit. Out the way. Uh, yeah. Not a fan of this. This is not going very well. Uh, dude, don't come towards me. Thank you. Didn't really want to waste a valuable shell on you, but uh, yeah, no. Needs must when the devil drives and all that. So somebody is throwing something at me. Or is it you up there playing with your crossbow? Probably. Didn't your mum ever tell you? Oh, playing. Really? You can shoot through that? Okay. I thought we were safe there. Well, maybe not. Come on. Uh, let's eat that. You can shoot at me. There you go. There we go. Lovely. I don't know where you're going, sir. Take your medicine. I'd have liked to have swiped you in the face, but unfortunately... Unfortunately, you're a goit and decided to wear a piss pot. Oh, hello. If you could go down on one knee for me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, let's disable you. Not a fan of that nasty little butt prod you have there. But that's okay. You can slap your cheeks with my knife. Uh, really? I don't want all these potato chips. Too many potatoes. I mean, it's true we could have shot in through that window there, but there's no real point, to be honest. Uh, especially not with the equipment we have. <coughs> right, so, we have options. Uh, no, we don't really have options. We have this room. Which, oh, flash grenade. That will help with the uh, coming empire. Certainly will. Is that all that's in here? Really? I vaguely remember there being some more goodies in there, but well, I mean, that wasn't bad, you know. Uh, flash grenade is definitely going to help towards the course. We've got a good amount of health here. The only thing that we don't have much of is handgun bullets. Which isn't a problem in itself because the handgun's kind of ass. But, uh, you know. Hopefully that's a problem that will sort itself out. Evening. Ah. Yes. Quite. I was just leaving some potato chips on the floor. I don't know why these potato chips shine the way they do, but... Who am I? To question these things. Ah, yes. Now. Uh, you know what? I might switch up to my control pad here. Just for the sake of QTEs. Yeah, man. There we go. Yeah, for the sake of duties, I might just <clears throat> not 
going to guarantee that's going to help me that much, but... <laughs> Ooh. Been a long time, comrade. Long time no see, Sonic. I died in the crash two years ago. Is that what they told you? You're the one who kidnapped Ashley. You got John quick, as expected. After all, you and I both know where we come from. What do you want? <laughs> A sample sampler developed, that's all. Leave Ashley out of this. Oh, I needed her to buy Sadler's trust in me. Like you, I'm American. Got her involved just for that? Oh, oh dear. Yeah, they, <laughs> those QTEs, man. You really have to hammer those buttons there. That's okay. Yeah, Krauser is like twice the size of Leon, to be fair. You got her involved just for that? All right, let's try that one again, shall we? Yeah, if you look at his scar there, you can actually see right through his character model. Right at the bottom. Kind of strange. Alright, come on. Get ready to mash your button. Umbrella. Umbrella. There we go. You can see right through his chest. To the great behind. Which is really weird. Ugh, God. That's a workout. I don't need to go to the gym. Well, if it isn't the bitch in the red dress. Looks like we have the upper hand here. <laughs> you may be able to prolong your life, but it's not like you can escape your inevitable death, is it? <laughs> well, that could be said to any of us, Krauser. You knew each other? More or less. Maybe it's about time you told me the reason why you're here. Maybe some other time. You didn't think it was going to be that easy, Raider, did you, Leon? Enjoy the reunion with your old friend. As a matter of <coughs> fact, I did. Wonderful. I wouldn't want my special guests on the island feeling unattended. Guess I'm <laughs> supposed to thank you, right? Ah, I have an idea. Since you're here, why don't I introduce you to it? It should keep you busy. Can't remember the name, huh? A senior moment, perhaps. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy the fun. <laughs> I love Sadler. Now, uh, if you actually care that much, if you wind that bit back, uh, and see on the video conference, you can see Sadler clipping through in Leon's video box there. Uh, I thought that was an issue that was unique to the console version, but nope, it is not. There we go. It's on the PC version as well. You can see uh, just in, if Leon's box was there, you can just in the corner see Sadler's robe. Uh, it wasn't there all the time, just now and again. So nope, that must have been in the OG game then. How interesting. Right, anyway. 
Uh, so, we had a nice little catch up with our buddy Krauser. Good lad, he is. Uh, right, now, if there's any goodies here, there's no goodies here. No goodies of any worth. Is there no ammo or anything up here? Uh, probably not. I mean, this was just an arena for Sadler and Leon to get reacquainted with each other, wasn't it? Yeah, my god, you really have to mash those buttons. You really do. Uh, never mind. Ooh, this looks nice and cleavy. I love Sadler. Oh, he's... Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We have QTEs here. I distinctly remember QTEs. Maybe. What's the style of the time? Yeah, QTEs. Ooh. Yeah, someone watched way too much of the first Resident Evil film, which actually was the better one, I think. It was the only good one, in my opinion. I know there's one or two people out there that like Resident Evil films, and that's fine, you know. If you enjoyed it, hey, more power to you, but... Ugh. Certainly wasn't to my taste. Holy shit, I remember watching the first Resident Evil film in <clears throat> uh, in school. I can't remember if it was in my final year of school or my second to last. I like this. You can take a pew. Yeah, much better. Yeah, I remember watching the first one. The first one wasn't bad. There's no time for resting. That's true, Leon. Uh, first one wasn't awful, I guess. Well, I mean, uh, it wasn't great, but in my opinion, and most people's opinions, but it wasn't terrible. And then it just drastically shit the bed from there. <clears throat> yeah, not my sort of thing. Okay. But then, to be honest, I haven't actually watched any of the Netflix Resident Evil stuff either, to be honest. I'm just... You know, people tell me about it, but I I just could not possibly be less interested. I hit... Well, I mean, I don't really watch... I don't watch TV or series or anything anyway, but... Yeah, I'd rather be gaming. Um, but again, that's 100% personal preference. I have tried to watch TV and stuff like that but it just you know I find it difficult to concentrate I find it difficult to sit down and you know switch off and enjoy things I used to I you know I used to watch all sorts of things but I find that very difficult these days and I know uh, see I want to watch the new Halo TV series but uh, I kind of really don't as well. I mean, Resident Evil and Halo are my two favorite franchises, and uh, yeah. Anyway, Lewis's memo four. I'll report my findings about the Plagueis here. The Plagueis have three distinct characteristics. One, as mentioned previously, the Plaga have the ability to manipulate the behavioral patterns of their hosts. Two. The Plaga are social organisms. By this, I mean instead of living individually, they live in perfect social harmony. It is believed that they have a collective intelligence. This type of behavior can be seen among insects. Uh, such as bees and ants. However, this kind of social behavior is rarely seen among parasitic organisms. Perhaps it was a learned behavior by the Plagas. How do you learn to be a social, uh, a hive intelligence? Is that something that can be learned? I don't know. Um, I'm not a bug scientist, man. Perhaps it was a learned behavior by the Plagueis. I'm finding out if this has any relationship with their first characteristic. Uh, the Plagueis have exceptional adap uh, adaptation skills. They are able to live off many kinds of organisms by creating a symbiotic environment quickly. This ability, when combined with their social behaviors, allows them to interact intelligently between hosts, regardless of the host uh, organism. I am ashamed to admit that my pure fascination with the Plaga in hindsight has blinded me to the true research objectives of the Los Illuminatus. 
Even with the knowledge that Sadler was going to abuse the results of the experiments, I could not pull myself away from my research. As a result, I am just as responsible for this whole mess as he is. I see now that I was wrong, but can I stop their evil plans alone? No, sadly you can't, Lewis. Yeah, I, I don't know, man. I Very... Should we save it? Because we're about to fight U3, and he's not bad, but... Uh, it's actually quite a cool enemy to be honest. I just um Yeah, with the basic weapons <laughs> Yeah, hmm, yeah, hmm, 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 hmm. I'm not sure how it's gonna go down um, I used to spend hours as well watching YouTube videos. I used to love watching YouTube videos, but <clears throat> As I kind of documented I just I don't have the attention span that I used to. I find it very, very difficult to sit down and just watch a screen. <clears throat> I wish I could, but I don't know. It's just one of those things, I guess. <laughs> right, so we're going to sell Thank that. You. I don't think we need those no. either. <laughs> Thank you. We've got plenty. Well, we don't have plenty. Ammo is going to be an issue here, I think. <clears throat> because... What are you uh, We've got plenty of health, which is cool. Come back at any time. Um, hmm. Yeah, I've, the thing is, I just I, I don't get a lot of spare time either. Yeah, I get about three hours on a work day to myself, and most of that is like you know, household chores. Ooh, one second, guys. Right. <clears throat> okay, sorry about that, guys. Uh, let's go. So, uh, this is going to be a thing. This is going to be a thing. This is going to be a thing. Yeah, I, I have tried to watch a few Let's Plays recently, but I just seem to get, like, one or two videos in. Uh, and then, I don't know, I just... Don't seem to continue with it. I don't know. It's one thing that I, I'm not happy with. I would like to just be able to switch off and watch a lot more content. But maybe it's a phase I'm going through. I don't know. <clears throat> so, the cage fight. Yes. Now... <sighs> I do like this guy. He kind of reminds me of um, uh, what are those things called from Fallout. Mancubus? No, not Mancubus, is it? Centaur from Fallout. Ashley. Oh no, Leon. What's that? Ooh. Hey, beautiful. Oh, he just wants a kiss. Look at him. Kissy, kissy boy. Uh, yeah, so. This guy is a bit of a goit. Probably shouldn't have wasted that bullet there as well. Also, I'm going to switch over to me mouth, uh, to me control pad. Oh, hi. Uh, this is awkward. This is very awkward. Oh, right, let's get past. Oh, nice. No, take it, please. Take it! Ooh, hello. Now we've got to go push all the buttons. Oh, we're out of range. That's gonna... We're gonna pay for that one, I think. Right, now we have to go get out of here. Ow, oh, yep, yeah, we're gonna get hurt. Ow. Oh, that's an instant kill, apparently. Oh, dear. Yeah, we might die a few times on this guy. He's not... He's not that tough. Uh, you've just got to, you know, run point to point here. I didn't realize that was an instant kill. Maybe you just need to have enough health. I'm not sure. Uh, do we want a mouse and... Uh, should I mouse and keyboard this, or...? Because the QTEs, I don't think, are too bad here. There's a lot of them, but I don't think they're very... Let's go mouse and keyboard. Fuck it. I just... I need that precision. 
<clears throat> Let's see how we go. Yeah, this bit is just going to come down to how switched on you are with the QTEs. However, could they have discovered... Oh, God. That tracking device that you put on her back, Leon. That slight... Oh, God. Hello. That's going to hurt. There must be another one. Yes, there is. You know what? Let's use that. And let's combine this. Oh, oh, hi. Hello. Didn't see you there, sir. You big ugly duckling. Now, you can actually throw a grenade up and over to hit that switch, apparently. I've seen it in a few videos, but we don't have many grenades. And they are precious. So, oh dear. That was uncomfortable. Yeah, I'm, I'm not great at QTEs, I'm not going to lie. But it's fine. We'll, we'll get through. We always get through. So, one cage down, three to go. Let's eat another herb. Don't re... Ah, lovely. It's very difficult to pick things up with a mouse and keyboard. Very difficult. Right, you got to be on your toesies. Keep on your toesies. Hey, dude. How would you like, actually, do we have to fight? Oh, we do have to fight here. Won't open, but there's got to be a way. Yeah, we can run past him. Oh, right, yeah, of course. There we go. Oh, you little son of a bitch. Get off me. Honestly. Uh, what's going on with the camera here? I don't quite remember it being this anus. Oh. With the old uh, camera, but hey. You know, nostalgia does. Nostalgia definitely blinds us. Oh, it really does. Right, let's. Yeah, that was a very. Did you hit? Oh. Okay. This could be bad. Oh, we're good. We're good. We ain't. We ain't. We're getting through this. We're getting through this. One sloppy, terrible maneuver at a time. Oh, yes. I forgot he does that. That wasn't even his final form, was it? Huh? Remember that meme? Huh? Yes. Papa Titan remembers that meme. Um, right. Uh, now, if I... Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, balls. This is gonna get uncomfortable. Now, I do remember... Somewhere... There was a green switch. Ow! I, can can we have control back, please? Thank you. This is getting uncomfortable. Um, ow. Right, there's almost no point in fighting him here because you can't really hurt him. You can just push him off a little bit, I think. Oh, yeah, I remember. We have to... Ah, yes. I'm being silly. I'm being silly. Of course I'm being silly. You know I'm always silly. Oh, Titan, you big old bellend. God, Titan, when did you get so shit at playing games? Well, I have news for you. Yeah, always. So, there we go. There we go. Yeah, but yeah that was a really odd sounding um, sound effect there. Kind of glitching out the audio. Yeah, the PC port is it's the best of an awful bunch, I guess. Right, okay, let's go. Now this is where the fun begins. Okay. Ooh. Goodbye.
Well, that wasn't too bad now, was it, Leon? Yeah, we had him. Not too bad at all. Kind of a bit of a joke of a boss, really. Why are you loading these magnum rounds up, Titan? You defeated the boss, right? <laughs> oh, sweet child. If only. Right, let's... Uh, we might use that nade. We might use... Oh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That's not very healthy, is it? Oh dear. 13 handgun rounds. That's not very healthy at all. Um, there's probably more. I guess there's going to be more. Hey, Boodalicious. Come on. Let's dance. Let us dance, you big ugly mofo. God, it looks like my bloody in-law, honestly. Right, um, oh dear. He's a bit tenacious, I'll give him that. Right, so, luckily we have these big flaming barrels everywhere, which are pretty nice. Definitely gonna be abusing these bad boys. Did that hurt it? I don't know. Yeah, so the... We get kind of like a very drawn out camera angle here and I'm going to be honest, not a fan. We are just gonna give it all of our mag rounds because kind of need to. We could finish it with a rocket launcher actually. Probably wouldn't be the worst. Uh, use of our rocket launcher but you know probably wouldn't be the best use of it either all right eat that you bastard uh can we thank you oh have you got underground i think you've got underground that's nope you haven't got underground okay cool Wait, was there only two explosive barrels here? Or was there more? I forget. Yeah, I think that's a one-hit kill. I honestly can't remember. Oh! That's not a one-hit kill. C and X. C and X is a wonderful button combination. Said nobody ever. Right. This is going to be uncomfortable. Leon, this is going to be uncomfortable, my friend. And I'm not really sure... Ooh, dear, oh dear. Uh, this might be... Yeah, this might be where we have to use the rocket launcher. Which is kind of a bastard because we've already used... Um... a good amount we've already used a good amount of uh, ammo here so I don't really want to squander that now let's see if we can take him out with what we've got uh, no promises run so what we like with the ammo then ah right good Ah, yeah. Okay. Run. Okay, yep. That hurts. That is rather uncomfortable. He's gone underground again, hasn't he? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. There you go. Good lad. Run. Yep takes a long ass time to get out of that shotgun animation. I probably should have gone for one shot there, not two, but we're really going to be using all of our health here, aren't we? Probably would be the answer. Right, let's reload. Now, if we can wait for him to go back underground. Or two shells. 
Yep, two shells at distance. Two shells at di- Oh, hey, hi, hello. Jesus, I could smell your gooch then. Which isn't really somewhere I'd want to be, to be honest. Oh, I thought he was dying. I really thought he was dying. That was my stupid fault. Right, he's gone back under. So when he goes under, I think when he comes back out, we could probably get two shots. Two shots off on him. Alright, let's wait for him to go back under again. I don't know how we can force him under. Is it a time thing? Do we have to run away from him for X amount of time or Oh hey friend. There we go. Nope. He's not going under. He's just showing me his big sharp pincers. Oh hey friend. He's had his can of monster now. He's moving. I don't like that. Monsters consuming Ooh dear. Monsters consuming caffeine shouldn't be a thing. Ah, there we go. Now he's gone under. Maybe he has to attack you X amount of times. Not sure. Okay. Oh, God. Dude. Dude. Got greedy. Went for a triple. Okay. Uh, went for a triple and paid for it. That was my fault again, trying to be greedy. Right, he's gone back under, though. Trouble is... Oh, God. Is that it? Nope. Right. Not going to go for another one. Nope. Two shots. Two shots is all you can get off. What have we got left? We actually have lots of shotgun ammo. Well, I say lots, you know, comparatively speaking. We have lots of shotgun ammo. So we don't need to re- we will reload. We'll go for a sneaky reload. There we go. Go for a sneaky sneak reload. Come on you, can you dive back under, please? This is very awkward. Come yeah, on. Not sure, to be honest, how much damage that's doing. Not much, I would imagine. Please submerge. No? Okay. Yeah, I didn't think you'd like to. I don't feel like I wasted that magnum ammo. Uh, I'm thinking... Oh, hi. I'm thinking that wasn't actually an awful waste of magnum ammo in the end. Yeah. Shotgun. Basically, if this isn't down its throat, it just tickles them. Oh, hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. Evening. Yes, you have a lovely set of teeth on you. You really do. All right. So I think it's how many times he attacks. That might be how it works. You coming out? Yeah, you're coming out. I right, remember. Two shots. Two shots. Shoot and scoot, boys. Shoot and scoots. Oh, he's gone back under. Oh, that's quick. Is that how much health he has, maybe? Oh. Maybe. Two shots. Don't get greedy now. Could have saved a lot of health by not getting greedy. That was also unwise, but hey, that's fine. Come on, dude. Go for your bite. Go on. There you go. There you go. And again. Yeah, <clears throat> so I think he attacks four times and then he goes underground. Seems to be. Alright, let's get into it. Oh dear. Big, nice open area. There we go. Yep, could have saved a lot of health there by doing the two shit. Two shit? Two shot hit scoot thing. So, hey, but it's a learning experience, you know. We have gained valuable insight. Right. All right. Not bad. Uh, I think that's everything that was there as well. 
I don't mind that boss, to be honest. He's all right. He's actually not that dangerous. Kind of severely tempted to redo that again to save all of our healing items. Because once you realize it's the two shot four attack thing, that's his pattern. He's actually probably really easy. He could probably do that quite comfortably without being hit, but it is what it is. Oh, look at that. We've come out with eight shotgun shells left. Uh, game? How about you do me a little solid and uh, sort me out with some ammo? Huh? Huh? Okay. Well, I mean a herb. I'll take a herb. That's, you know, you meet me halfway game. Uh, I can't say you know, much more than that, I suppose. You met me halfway. Now, we could go back. I don't know if there's a reason, to be honest, to go back. Is there? Is there, like, some stuff back there that we potentially missed? We have a quick squiz. I don't think there's anything back here. This is probably just in case you want to go to the merchant. Uh oh. Well that was definitely worth it. Another green herb. Uh I think that's it really. Well, um Uh, I guess we're gonna go. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go back and save it now. I wait. Is there? A, is that the end up there? Might be the end up there. But this video is like forty odd minutes long now, so yeah, I think we're gonna go back and save it. We've we've accomplished a little bit. We've done another boss. Kind of a. I'm not a hundred percent happy with how that went. Definitely could have done that better. You know, by realizing the attack pattern sooner, but I'm stupid. My brain is old and tired. But that was a good fun boss anyway. So, anyway guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. When we come back, well, we're going to go keep uh, moving forward. See if we can run into old buddy Krauser again. Till then guys, thanks for watching.